ओके गाइस इट्स मी इमाद फ्रॉम नेल्सन डार्विन पाक टेक यूट्यूब चैनल इन दिस वीडियो ट्यूटोरियल वी विल लर्न अबाउट द सिमुलेशन ऑफ डाइस विद द हेल्प ऑफ ऑर्डिनो यूनो द प्लेटफॉर्म वी आर यूजिंग फॉर सिमुलेशन इज द प्रोटियस हेड प्रोफेशनल सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्ट इट फर्स्ट वी नीड टू टेक अवर ऑर्डिनो यूनो you must know that arduino you know is not the built in part of the proteus so you should have to download its library first you need to download its library and then you can you need to copy that library and paste it inside the library folder of the proteus and how you can download this library and use it inside the proteus you have to uh, google it out or if there is any sort of confusion you can comment down and i will respond in no time okay first uh, take your arduino you know then we need to take our push button now this is our push button connect its one end with the pin number 13 of the digital pin number 13 of the arduino uno and now connect the other end of the push button with the 5 volt dc okay now this is done and one more thing that you also need to put a pull down resistor so we can take one 1k pull down resistor because it will prevent any sort of voltages dumping on the pin number 13 and make it ground so there there will be perfect logic zero on the pin number 13 so that's why we are using these pull down resistors okay now after it we need to take some leds like led green or red or any other leds but uh, it's okay we are taking green leds make them oh sorry like uh, rotate them like this okay and we need around like a six leds so copy to clipboard and paste from clipboard paste from clipboard paste from clipboard and paste from clipboard sorry and paste from clipboard now you need to join the negative ends of these leds okay like that now we need to connect this common part with the ground okay now first we first led will be connected with the digital pin 7 of the arduino you know the other with the pin number 6 the next with the pin number 5 and the other with the pin number 4 and this one pin number 3 and this with the pin number 2 okay now this is our circuit for dies okay so we will we we need to go to our code okay now here we have declared pin number 2 to 7 as output because leds are connected with this pin then 
pin number 13 has input because our button push button is connected with this pin so whenever we will press the button it will make high the uh, pin status that is there the, it will read the logic one on the pin so when there is logic one then all the conditions within this if statement will be executed okay so it will check then that either a random number generated is one two three or four or even up to six so and how random number is generated yeah due to this command that is random one comma seven one is the lower limit and seven is the upper limit and then rand number so it will store all this inside this integer type variable that is rand number and then it will be displayed uh, yeah you can see the code but i will uh, give the coding file in the description so you can download it from here so So you can see the code as well if you want to write or learn something yeah you can see it okay now after done compiling we need to copy the hex file after it we need to paste it out in the Arduino you know and press ok then ok now when we will press the button we will see that what will happen now we can see that uh, 2 is on okay like 2 and okay yeah there is error but it's okay wait now again two and then six okay when they will off we will again press the button now three okay now when it will off we will press the button and now five so you can see that random numbers are generated we cannot predict random means we cannot predict the next number so uh, press the button and okay press the button and okay so hopefully you got this concept that how you can make a dice with the help of Arduino Juno inside the Proteus so don't forget to subscribe and thanks for visiting our channel